I don't know about you, but the last thing I want when I have guests come over to hang out is to think that my home smells like poopy diapers. It smells horrible! It smells like diapers in here. That's why I use a diaper disposal bag for those particularly stinky, messy diapers. As I've shown in previous videos, this can be simple plastic grocery bags that you save from the grocery store, or you can also purchase them on Amazon by searching for diaper disposal bags or nappy disposal bags. Personally, my approach for years has been just to take the dirty diapers out to the dumpster, to the outside trash can as soon as possible. Ugh, I smell a messy diaper. No! It wasn't me! Then of course there's always candles and air freshers that are always available for helping to cover up bad smells. That is one thing to keep in mind about different types of air fresheners and candles is that they generally cover up the smell or mingle with the smell rather than totally eliminate or neutralize it. While these types of products can be helpful keeping your home smelling fresh and clean, sometimes the stench of dirty diapers is just too powerful. When the accumulation of smells becomes a constant problem, it's common for many of us to go to the next step up from diaper disposal bags to a diaper pail. And then you take the poopy diaper and you put it in the poopy diaper pail. Diaper pails are supposed to be this invention that is made to contain the smells of dirty diapers. I say supposed to because I found out rather quickly once I got my own that they more often become a collection point of smells rather than a containment point of smells. Which made it even worse! I can't stand that smell anymore! I even found out that once you empty it of dirty diapers, the smell actually kind of lingers inside of the pail. Now what we really need to talk about are deodorizing products. Speaking of deodorizers, I just gotta throw out there real quick that Dynamo's diaper powder does have baking soda in the mixture, which in and of itself serves as a deodorizer. So if you want to give the beta version of Dynamo's diaper powder a try, go to thediaperdynamo.com right now to get your product today. I'll put a link to the storefront in the description below. It was actually a specific diaper deodorizing product that inspired me to pursue creating my own powder to begin with. And that product is the Diaper Dust. This is a product that you sprinkle into your used diaper before you roll it up and throw it away and absorbs all the bad smells right at the source. This is one of the best solution to poopy diaper smells. I I've ever come across. But how does it work, you ask? For a while now, I've actually been wondering how exactly this product works. It works by attacking odor with a double punch. That's better. Now straighten up and meet the renegade. The powder itself is basically just comprised of baking soda and activated carbon. To the best of my understanding, the activated carbon has pores in it that attract and trap odor molecules. I'm stuck. I can't get out. Baking soda works through a chemical reaction with the odor molecule, basically destroying and eliminating it entirely. The diaper dust is at the top of my list of must have tools to have in your diaper changing supply arsenal. Ready right the arsenal. Yeah, it's a load. That said, it got me wondering what other types of products there might be that actually absorb or effectively neutralize odor altogether. While the diaper dust is great at neutralizing the smell from the inside of the diaper out, there's still extra measures that can be taken like in a fresh odor absorber, bamboo charcoal bags, and even Arm & Hammer nursery fresheners. I think all of these products will be great to place inside of your diaper pail or your trash can to help absorb additional odors. Baking soda actually works better at diffusing odors when it's sprinkled out instead of in a clump or in a block. You could just keep a box of baking soda somewhere nearby your diaper pail so that way every time you go to throw away your diaper you just sprinkle a little bit on top and it helps fight those bad smells for you. In fact I think I'll go ahead and do some experimenting with that and let you know how it goes. It certainly would be an easily affordable solution if you're constantly worried about your friends noticing dirty diaper smells. When we worry about things like our friends smelling our dirty diapers it can cause us to avoid hanging out with them. That's why it's really important to address this concern so you don't let your issues cause you to self-isolate and not socialize. For more signs that diapers are keeping you from socializing check out this video next. And if you got any value out of this video, hit that like and subscribe for the next one. Until next time, stay dry.